to be blunt, MIT is fortunate. We're an elite school. You know, we're one of the best in the world. Our admission rate is uh, sadly about 3%. We admit about 3% of our applicants. But what do we look for? Um, we certainly look for smarts. These kids are incredibly bright. But one of the things we look for, and this is a place where a community could help, we look for resilience. Doesn't matter how smart you are, you're going to show it up on heat and something's going to go wrong. Another way of saying it is everybody at MIT is an undergraduate. It's the top of their class or maybe second in their class. Well, guess what? By the laws of mathematics, half of you are now below average. This is a strange place to be and it's a little challenging. And so resilience, oh, how have you dealt with something hard? How have you dealt with failure is something really important. That's why going back to something I said, the young lady over here, be willing to be bold because something's going to fail and you're going to learn from that. To the extent that Estevan can create spaces, create programs that help students take risks and then deal with them well and show resilience. I know that's something that MIT looks for. Um, put it this way, we have two applicants. One of them grew up in Lexington, Massachusetts, where I happen to live, where 35% of the fathers of the students at the high school have doctorates and 15% of the mothers have doctorates. This is an incredibly educated town. You've got a student coming from there, and you've got a student coming from being fake, or bien fait, if you like, although we, we know we don't pronounce it that way. And I don't mean to pick on bien fait, but it's a different kind of setting. You don't have the same advantages of Lexington, Massachusetts. If you have two students who look the same, you know who MIT picks? The kid from bien fait because given where they're coming from, they've shown that resilience to move forward in a better way. So I'm not saying, please don't dumb down Estevan and make it a really terrible place so that you're lower, but find ways to help your kids show resilience, explore things, try things out, show that they're willing to take that gamble. That's what we look for.